Should I try um Tank Cat next game? I do want to show you guys like what I came up with when it came to Tank Cat, even though the Tank Cat dream was, yes, ruined. What is up, guys? It's Cat Life. Today's video is brought to you by Summoner's War. Summoner's War is the classic mobile turn-based RPG where you can collect over thousands of unique monsters. You can create your own team and try out different various team compositions and strategies and strengthen your monsters with runes to progress in the game and clear different dungeons. You can take your team and test them out in the global PvP arena and take part in weekly in-game events. You can also customize your own Sky Island. And to celebrate 6 years since first launching, they are giving away 100 free summons. They have 110 million installs and is a beloved global hit with a huge community worldwide. If you download now, you will get 100 mystical scrolls for free. If you're looking for a good mobile game, try out Summoner's War. The link will be in the description below. I mean, tank cap build is always situational. Depends on how many like AP champions they have, how many AD champions they have, what's their biggest threats. So it's really situational builds. Like, so Leandries would be my Leandries and Void are like my damage items, right? And then going like Hex and then Sunfire kind of helps me like tank the more uh, Lissandra, and then it helps me tank the Morg just a little bit. But because their biggest threats aren't AP, and Lissandra was kind of behind, I just stacked armor. Because I knew Lissandra wasn't going to deal much damage to me anyway. Like, because I'm already tanky with the health. I just went, like, armor after that. But you also want to make sure you have your damage. Like, Tank Cat is kind of pointless if you don't have damage. So that's kind of where the Harvest comes in. And that's kind of where the Leandris comes in. And you saw, like, the damage I was doing. You still do a lot of damage to champions that don't have, like, any MR. Because Katarina just does so much damage on her own. But like, let's say your team has like a shit ton of AP champions and they start building MR, then Tank Cat is harder to pull off. Like, you're not going to be doing damage because they're going to start building MR on you. Yeah, generally with Tank Cat, it's, it's kind of like to be oppressive. Like, you want to build Tank Cat kind of when you're ahead so that you get your items sooner. And the items are relatively cheap. But it doesn't like compare to Gunblade, right? Gunblade is still like probably the best item. So that's why sometimes when I go tank build, like I can go Gunblade too. Like go Gunblade into like, I like the Frozen Heart build. Gunblade, Frozen Heart into like MR or whatever. And I just get ulti hunter. And that's where my damage comes in. And it's with the Gunblade too. So just going like 40% CDR tank hat is also pretty good too. Tank, yeah. First of all.
Give me just dive in towers, bro. Have to wait for the harvest. Give me on the least and for some reason. Shit. 